Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back, finally, to WW2K23, my rise. I know it's been a minute, it's been a minute, it's been a minute. I know, I know, I know. But with the announcement of AEW Fight Forever coming out June 29th, I need some type of time to be able to finish my rise for the for the men for the men and then my rise for the women. I have about 28 days until, so I should be able to finish this. We might be on the last part of this this My Rise of Lock, so hopefully we hopefully we can complete it and do what we gotta do. Um, I did say in my last video I was gonna change my look. I kind of changed it. You're kind of gonna see where I was where I was going with it. Um, I changed up my finisher. I changed up my signature again. <laughs> well, one of my signatures I changed up, and my finishing I've changed up. One of my finishers, one of my signatures, I changed up. That's pretty much what it is. All right. So, last time we were last seen, we just came back to WWE. Our NXT UK and Heritage Cup have been taken away from us, so we don't have that anymore. So now here we are back in WWE. And the first person we're going to talk to is Xavier Woods. Cannot wait to hear what Xavier Woods has to say. All right, X. What's up? No welcome back gift basket. What the hell, man? No, not after what happened to you last time. I can't even look at our WWE 2K game cover now without having flashbacks. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was under a lot of pressure and trying to find my way with a new faction, but I've gained some perspective in my time away from WWE. So what do you say we start over? Friends? I can consider that. But an I'm sorry gift basket would help your cause. I mean, I can go get one. You know, I, I can I can figure it out. You know what I'm saying? Um, let me see. Let me see. What do you look like? You look like a guy that could use an, use a, a partner for, uh, for your trombone. I forgot what his trombone's name is. I forgot what he named it. Um... I forgot what he named it. Damn. But, you know, some for your trombone, you know what I'm saying? Um, fried chicken. You know, you, you like you like some good fried chicken. I'm getting racist now. I'm, I'm going to stop. <laughs> I'm going to stop. If that's all it takes, deal. Deal. And maybe a skywriting apology message as well. Okay, you wildin'. <laughs> okay, you wildin'. <laughs> Don't push it. I just got back to WWE. I ain't got that WWE type of money, bro. Like, <laughs> wait, you wallet. You are wallet. All right, let's go. Let's continue. Look at that smug bastard in the. Look at, look at that smug bastard in the background. He got my title. That's that's my title. I'm the WWE champion. I'm going to be that. Once I get my title back, you already know what time it is. Come on now. Who knows what we're about to hear from this man, but either way, it should be interesting. I just can't believe he's back. See my new you look. Think you'd see this again? I see, the last time I was in a WWE ring, I was fired. Everything I had worked for was gone in an instant. I was lost. Without that fight to be the future world champion, the lock. We'll get to that in a second. I didn't know where to turn next. But then I realized that even though I was knocked down, I wasn't knocked out. There was an entire world of wrestling outside of WWE. New challenges, new stages, new fights. So I set out to conquer that wrestling, and I did. Leaving WWE no choice but to bring back the man who had been cast aside as a mistake, never to be seen again. The man you see here tonight is not the same man who was fired. That man was the lock. And I'm here to tell you, the lock 
is officially dead. Oh my god. From now on, you're gonna get the real thing. The man who went out and fulfilled his potential all around the world. Cody Rhodes. Uncuffed and unleashed. Drew McIntyre, Bobby Lashley. Nothing stands in my way from doing what I already did across the globe. Yeah. I'm conquering this last territory by winning the WWE Championship. Talk! Talk to them! But now that I'm back, what's really... Here we go. These two have some serious history. Uh, here we go. Here we go. What a big dog. Beautiful speech. Almost even had me believe in you for a second. Not to rain on your comeback parade. Let me hit you with at least a drizzle of truth. Talk to me. You might have managed to win a few matches while you were gone. And pulled off some cheap publicity stunts like a dating NXT UK and taking their titles for a joyride. But let's get one thing straight. You don't belong here. We tried everything in our power to help you succeed. And it flat out didn't work. So despite everything you just said, I'm not inclined to try again. Well, I'm back. So you don't have a choice, do you? Yeah, about that. You might have maneuvered your way back to WWE. But that doesn't mean I can't make your life a living hell now that you're here. So what? You're going to force me to be the lock again? Nope. But there has been a slight revision to your new contract. Little detail you might want to consider. And that is, if you don't become WWE Champion within 58 days from today, <coughs> which just so happens to coincide with SummerSlam, you will be gone from WWE permanently. Forever, or as you said, knocked out. So yeah, good luck with this whole comeback thing. Wow, that's shocking news. You might not want to walk away when I'm talking to you. It didn't work out so well for you last time, did it? Do I need to repeat myself? 58. Days. Why wait? Give me a championship match against my old buddy Slade, and we'll get this over with tonight. No chance. Fifty-eight days. It's WWE Champion Slade. Slade looks determined <laughs> as he heads to uh. Yeah, determined to prove that a hell of a lot has changed since the former Lock left WWE. Slade may have taken a back seat in the past, but now he's the man on Raw. That's he is the WWE Sean champion. Said, there wouldn't be a title match tonight, so I'm not sure what Slade is doing out here. If you haven't noticed, things have changed around here since you've been gone. In fact, if anyone's the lock now, it's me. Since unlike you, I actually became WWE champion. Convenient how that happened when I was gone. Are you saying I'm only champion because you weren't here? Duh. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Let's get this straight. I'm not threatened by you. So if you want to take your shot at my title and try to save your job here in WWE, then I actually agree with you for once. Let's do this right now. Well, Let's go. What's up? Nah, Sean. Nah, back up, bro. We want to do it. What's up? Let's do it right now. Michael doesn't look too thrilled. Okay, fine. You got what you wanted. The match is on. <laughs> I'm gonna beat his ass. Yeah, I'm gonna beat his ass. Let's go. That title is coming home to the boy. 
match on night one. I agree, Corey. There has to be more to this plan. Nonetheless, here we go. But before we even get any further, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I just want to. I just want to piggyback on what, some, what Mr. Shawn Michaels said. He said he put in my contract. I have 58 days to become WWE champion. So pretty much, I have until SummerSlam to become WWE champion. If I don't become WWE champion, then I, I'm out. Which is the weirdest thing to put in somebody's contract. But you still beefing with me, bro. It's all good. You just mad. Forget the WWE Championship. I want a piece of HBK's ass. <laughs> That's what I want. I want a piece of the heartbreak kid. You know what I'm saying? Give me Shawn Michaels. Give me Michael Higginbottom. Yeah. Let's get personal. But you know what? Let's kick Slay's ass one time. Let's do this. Oh, I think it's still Hall of Fame, too. I need to get my glasses checked to make sure this is actually happening. But Slade and his former Hurt Business team are squaring off right now for the WWE Championship. Here's a pin for the title. Hey, match just started, big dog. You better get off me. Not time to expect victory yet. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with this hole. Yeah, the, you can tell this is all legend because I'm, <laughs> I'm doing bad early. Jesus, I'm, <laughs> I'm doing horrible. Going right after this ain't going well. <laughs> what the? F right, I can't block that. It's not an attack. I can't block that. Yeah, I'm getting my ass beat right now. <laughs> I'm getting my ass beat. Jesus, he's WHM for a for reason, apparently. Holy crap, can I breathe? Hey, let me, nah, let me roll out the damn ring. <laughs> what the hell going on? I can't. There we go, finally attack on. Yo, what the fuck? Yo, my man. Jesus, all right, cool. God damn, yo. The hell going, yo. There we go, Jesus. He countered that. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Yo. What the fuck? Yo! I understand this dude is a champion, but good lord. <laughs> oh crap, I didn't. Uh, oh crap, I could have countered it. <sighs> What the? What the hell? What the hell? How does he keep recovering so fast? Finally. Bam. Jesus. I got him. Yeah, I love how the ref just slid in per <laughs> slid in the perfect position. Now, Sean, if you want if you want these hands, all you gotta do is get in this ring. I'll be willing to beat your Wow. Wow. I'm kicking out though. Watch me kick out. Never mind. The champion retains. The challenger never really had a chance against the combination of the hurt business and Shawn Michaels. I don't see how he can win the championship in the next 58 days with the deck stacked against him like this. Hey man. Hey. I need some help. <laughs> Tavis. Damn, don't beat him up. No. Tavis. No, don't what? Don't make me look. 
Don't make me look. His mentor is taken out by the hurt business. No, no, no. He, he's going to do it. Slade Runner onto the steel chair. Slade Runner. Expected his big return to go here tonight. Welcome back to WWE, Lock. You've got a long, daunting road ahead of you. I agree, but I don't know about the long part. He's got less than 60 days to take Slade's championship, or he's gone from WWE forever. This is not looking good. Certainly long odds to overcome. Slade Runner? That's the damn kill switch. Like, are you serious? Come on, Slade Runner. Like, that suck, man. All right. All right. <sighs> okay. It took my man Tavish out, though. Rough first night back. How you doing? I've been better. I wasn't planning on fighting the WWE champion and his entire faction. Thought maybe we'd ease into things and build up to that. Yeah, same. Well, thanks for trying to help. I had no idea Sean was going to pull that stunt with your contract. What'd he say? 58 days to win the title or you're gone? 58 days. Yep. Summer slam or bust. Well, I doubt you're going to get another opportunity tonight. So really, it's 57 days. How many actual events is that? 57 days is like eight weeks with one Raw a week plus a premium live event. So you might have, what, like nine chances left? Then again, it's not like you're going to get a title match every show. They actually might do everything in their power to never give you another title match at all. Is any of that supposed to make me feel better? I know it's going to be tough, but I've already overcome so much just to get back here. I'll figure out a way to beat this too. I believe in you. I really do. But this feels different. You think I can't do it? No, I think you're outnumbered. You can't just brute force this on your own like you always do. You're gonna need help to pull it off. I got you, don't I? As you saw tonight, that's pretty much the same as being on your own. You need to lean on someone other than me. You did it in Mexico, now's the time to take it to the next level. They have numbers. So even up to sides. So you want me to join a faction? That didn't work out too well the last time. I wasn't saying you should join a faction. I was saying you should start your own and lead one. You're ready. I guess I don't really have another option, do I? Not unless you want to keep getting beaten up three on one for the next 57 nights and then be gone from here for good. Well, then I better start looking. Clock's ticking. Okay. Starting my own faction. That doesn't sound like a bad idea. Question is, who do I have in choices of members? Is the question I'm asking. All right, that story is complete. That story was fast. <clears throat> All right, so let's see. Story progress. Oh, I guess that was the New World Border, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. All right, so we're so we're so we're officially okay. So we're officially into this. Teamwork makes the dream work. Okay. Um. All right, cool. So I guess that was me returning to WWE. Gave myself a little, little bit better. Um, I'll be back for the next episode. So let's do that. So until next time, peace, love, wanted. Here.